Hey guys, it's me, Alex. Um, yes, yeah, so I can give you guys another video tonight, just because I'm bored. Anyways, this one's going to be short. Uh, this is a request by uh, this person. I'll put them up on the screen. Um, anyways, this is a Robin X listener. It's just a like a quick little like one shot type thing. Um, but anyways, it's of course not scripted all in my head. It's probably going to be short just because I do have school tomorrow and I'm getting extremely tired and it's almost 11 o'clock here and I go to bed at 10.30 so I shouldn't even be up. <laughs> anyways, um, I'm going to do this video so let's get into it. Finny, someone's at the door. Okay, Gwen, I'll be down in a minute. <laughs> Whatever, I'll just get it. What do you want? Robin, hey. Oh, Gwen. Hey, is the sitter home? Yeah, they're up in their room. Why? You usually come to hang out with Finny. Oh, yeah, uh, I'm helping them with some English homework. I thought you were bad at English. No, that's math. Finny helps me with math. I help Lishner with English. Yeah, sure. Come on in. I'll let Finny know you're here. No, don't. Why not? Um, just don't let him know I'm here. I want to tell him myself. Gotta be a surprise. You know? Mm hmm. Finny's up in his room getting dressed. Lishner is in the room right next to his. Yeah, I know. They're twins. I'm not an idiot. Okay, well, whatever. My dad won't be home. He's at work. So you can work with the door closed. Just no funny business, you two. What are you talking about? Oh, come on, Robin. It's obvious you guys are together. You've been coming over more frequently to see the listener and not Finny. Sure, you still hang out with Finny, and you guys still get together, but I see the way you look at her. I see the way you give my sister those eyes. You're not slick. Finny's just oblivious. That's why he hasn't found out. But I would tell Finny soon, or else he'll get mad. I know, and I'll tell him soon. You better. Anyways, hurry up. And no funny business. I hear any sort of sounds. I'm coming up there and I'm breaking that door down. And you and listener will lose door privileges. Yeah, whatever, Quan. Robin walks uh, up the stairs to your room and knocks at your door. Hey, listener. It's me. I'm gonna come in, okay? So... What you doing? Nothing. How did I get in here? Um, Gwen answered the door, so... I told her I was helping you with English homework. Yeah. No. She knows. She says that we're... Obviously together. She can see it, obviously. Uh... I don't know how Finny hasn't found out, but she says it's because he's oblivious. But I just guess it's because he doesn't like to pay attention to detail. I mean, yeah, sure, he's like good at everything, but honestly, when it comes to people's relationships, I really don't think he cares. Yeah. How oh, come here? I miss you. I haven't seen you since, like, well, the weekend. <laughs> yes, I know this isn't technically English homework or helping with English, but isn't this like a lot better? Just me, you. Your room, in the bed, cuddling, <laughs> kisses. <laughs> God, I could just fall asleep with you like this. 
you're so warm and soft and oh, beautiful. <laughs> Hey, listener, have you? Robin? Finny, hey. Um, <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, um, I came by, and, and why aren't you in my uh, twins' bed under the covers? hands wrapped around them and obviously had a uh, bed kissing them um their lipstick is over your lips all over uh Fetty, <laughs> i can explain that explain okay fine me and listener have been dating what what Listen, we didn't want to tell you with, like, you being their twin at all. Like, Robin, I don't care. You're happy. I know you've liked them. You make it pretty obvious. I just never thought you told them. You never brought it up anymore after that, so I thought you got over them more. You were trying to. Although, now that I do know... We have a few rules. Listener, you're listening to these rules too. Rule number one. That door stays open all the time. I do not care. Okay, yes, I know. I may sound like a f like dad to you, listener. But that door stays open all the time. Number two. If I walk in and you're b ass naked and listener is in, I don't know, whatever they're in. I'm smacking the shit out of you. Also, if a listener comes up and tells me that they're whatever, pregnant or something, you're dead. I, I don't care. I'm, I'm going to kill you. You may be my best friend, Robin, but, but I'm going to kill you. Um, another thing. Um, quit leaving me out of shit, bro. You need to tell me this stuff. Especially when it comes to family. I know, Finny. And I was scared. Really. The Robin Olerano is was scared to tell his best friend something. Well, I thought, I don't care. You know this. Remember that time when you told me that Vance broke up with his girlfriend and then go went and went with that best friend? And I said, wow, so cool. Walked off, got some gummies, and left. I don't care. Now... With my sis with my twin, it's a little different. They are my twin, and we're blood. So if you break their heart, I break your legs. But you know, uh, Fiddy, please don't break my legs. Don't break their heart. And if you break his heart, good for you. What? Listen, I'm their twin. I kind of have to go with them. I'm sorry. <sighs> and I'm leaving. I'm sorry. I can't. <laughs> Robin, I never said that I'll be back tomorrow. That's it. I'm sorry. I'm so tired. And I'm sorry if it was shit. Um, but I'm so tired and I need some sleep. Anyways, I hope you guys had have rest, awesome rest of your morning, day, or night. Bye-bye.